Uh, I want y'all to see, um, check this out. This killer be the goddamn witch trying to general. You got a witch. I'm burning their goddamn asses up. Y'all, y'all ask for it. Here you go. I can give my little analysis of this, uh, this carbonation coat. And what I'm going to show to y'all is just how broken the members are. And when you become part of a coat, you have to do 110%. You can't do 80%. You can't do 90%. You can't do 99.9%. .9%. You have to do 100% of what the coat says. And sometimes these coats are disguised as just movements. Just like I did my video the other day on the, uh, the red flag laws and stuff with like a lot of militia groups and stuff. They ran just like coats. You can't say, you can't be one of the militia people and, and say, um, oh, what, what was a good example? I, I don't believe that um, we should have to pay taxes. Or, that, I'm just saying this shit, thing, and I don't know too much about the militia. Shit. But I'm going to use the example I know, right? I had a guy on my show, and he said that he feel that we shouldn't have to Stop at stop signs if we don't want to, right? And then I, the way I didn't think he saw where I was going with it, right? And he was just talking and talking, right? And what we dug out was that he got that ideology from the group that he was in or or the, the surrounding of that community. You know what I'm saying? And when you join a community like that, you have to join it all the way. You can't have one little thing to yourself. If, if you do, you out. When you're in the Hebrew Israelite cult and they tell you that you can't um, deal with women of another nation and stuff, and but you got a white, you got a white wife and, and 10 goddamn kids. They can tell you you have to leave your fucking wife, nigga. You have to leave your wife. And you gotta do it. Well, I've been with this woman 20 years. We don't give a fuck. Your, your wife celebrate Christmas. She's not an Israelite yet. Oh, oh, she got a Christmas tree in the house. You got to get rid of that shit. There's no compromise. Now, what I'm going to show y'all, watch this, y'all. Watch, watch. See, motherfuckers just play this shit. They don't explain it. That's what I don't like a lot about a lot of content creators that cover this shit. They doing it for the, the gossip and the fuckery and shit. I'm doing it to help y'all motherfuckers so y'all motherfuckers don't join this shit. And a lot of the content creators, what, what they're going to do is uh, they, they, they cover this stuff. They laugh at it. They say it's fucked up. This man is wrong. But guess what? Those motherfuckers can so easily be riding that same shit. A lot of them is in this goddamn same shit. When I was in tour, um, fucking the Judah Nasty group, right? That's what I'm going to call it now. Nah, Judah Nasty group. So... Y'all go watch the video. It's like one of my first videos. It's called um, The Masonic Origins of the uh, One West Hebrew Israelites or whatever, right? Um, I don't agree with like 70% of what I said in there now, but the history is dead on. Y'all go check out that video. But I thought I was out the cult, but I was still in a cult. I was in a cult saying that some other shit's a cult. Right, let's, let's get on with the video shit. Hit the like button, share, and subscribe to this video. If y'all like my content, you can donate. The, the link will be in the description. It's Cash App, dollar sign, Colt Buster, C-U-L-T-B-U-S-T-R. Y'all can send me a donation. I'll shout your name out on every video that I do here, here on out. So let, let, let's go. Goddamn, Tia fucked up my video. Well, fuck it. I'll keep it up on there and shit. Fuck it. Ain't got a number on there. Yeah, JJ7000. <laughs> I know you're salty, dog, but let's go. Oh, yeah. And, 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 and today's show is sponsored by Common Sense. I can, uh, <laughs> I, I can teach it to you, but I can't understand it for you. <laughs> no, 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 I'm sorry. 
Today's show is sponsored by Common Sense. <laughs> I can explain it to you, but I can't understand it for you. Maybe I just said the same thing. I don't know. But anyway, let's go, y'all. Let's go. Let's have some fun. Have it fun while you learn. These dumbass bitches. Consistent, persistent, nigga. We keep pressing this pressure on these niggas. We don't stop all day, every day. We live it, eat it, shit, and breathe it. You feel me? Watch this. You niggas ain't even ready for us, real. We come from the future. We came back here. We're dimensional beings from different realms. We're not even human beings. You see the agreement? We not even human beings. He got these dumbass bitches thinking that they come from goddamn out of space like motherfucker Malachi York said. These bitches ain't got no goddamn sense. And that's why today's show is sponsored by Common Sense. They're, intimate, they're interdimensional beings and all this fucking dumbass, monkey-ass shit, right? Now, you see them agreeing with that, right? They're like, yeah, that's right. We the chosen. We the chosen and all this shit, right? Same thing the Hebrew Israelites do. That's right. When they're out on the street corner teaching, they say a scripture. That's right. Let's go. They think that we're regular just like them, but we come from an interdimensional being, uh, interdimensional beings, interhuman bodies. Put that push in me. What I said. What I said. Bitch. Right there. The remote. Right there. That the TV. Fuck on with you, bro. Now, this is another technique. He'll disrespect one to make the others feel stronger. Call a bitch all out her name, and she trying to get all her shit together because she don't want to leave. They sitting up in there and shit. They, they, they eating their little veg vegan food and, and fruits and shit, and they thinking this shit is good for them and and all this fucking crazy ass shit. And by him doing that, it solidifies the other members. Well, he not cussing. He not calling me no bitch. He fine and all this shit and, and all this bullshit, right? Let, let's go. I'm going to show you something real deep. Watch. That's right. You better fall in line, bitch. See? All the foolishness. Hey, put that push your feet. Hey, put that push your feet on. Watch. Let's go. That's all we live in this dog, nigga, real nigga shit. Hey, give me the kick. Smack her. Look. Look. That's right. You fall in line, bitch. You fall in line, bitch. She feeling some type of way. They lied and shit she feel, but she gonna fall in line, bitch. You ain't got your hoes in check like I got my hoes in check. Yeah, they be disrespectful and they be a little, cause they black. If I had white girl and white girl with this, Chinese girl with this, I broke the black bitch. You ain't broke the black bitch like I broke her. Push me. Push me. <laughs> you, ain't broke, you ain't broke these black bitches like I broke her. <laughs> See? Same thing the Hebrew Israelites do. They think they teach that the, the man supposed to have all authority over the woman. If the woman goes out her place that they set up for her, she is a whore. That's why he called her a bitch. Check yourself, bitch. Right? Y'all got to understand this. Y'all don't understand this shit. This is the pimp game, God damn it. I used to write... I, I I had an exam one time. These niggas was like, yo, I ain't gonna say my real name and shit. I just gonna say killer and shit, right? We we at this bar and shit. These niggas, I dress like a regular nigga. Like I'm like I was a skater, I'm a skater motherfucker. So shit, I wearing some old, a different shit than what everybody else in the fucking bar or club wearing, right? 
I wear my regular old shit like I wear it every day. I'm not wearing all this Gucci, fucking fancy, expensive ass shit. These niggas had to work two weeks to buy that all outfit and shit to wear, right? And I was like, yo, I'll take that bitch from you. He was like, yo, go, go ahead, Killer B. Yo, go ahead with that bullshit, right? At the end of the night, I was like, yo, what's my name? She's like, Freaky Killer B, Freaky Killer B. He liked to look at me. He said, what? I said, yo, what's my name? Had the girl say it again. That motherfucker looked at me. Like, yo. <laughs> Is that easy? Like, freak killer me, freak killer me. I, I may have said my name twice. I said, when well, you, you say my name, you say it twice. And I, I, I had this shit like that. And I've done that shit many times. And, like, it's disgusting. It's weird. It's shit. But it just shows how some... I don't know. That's a whole nother show. I'm going to leave that shit alone. That's a whole nother show. Y'all can ask me about this in the comment boards and shit. I'll break it down. Have a little fun with y'all. But this is what he doing. My bad. I got go, had a phone call and stuff. But, uh, oh yeah, if anybody knows this guy's like main channel or, or, or something like that, yo, let, let me know in the comments and stuff so I don't have to go search around and stuff. But anyway, let, let, let's go. Play, god damn it. That's just like the 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 IUIC military cadence. My but my fucking dumb ass had the bright idea to, to tell office uh, officer Shed, well, he was an officer at the time in, in IUIC, that yo. Back in the day, in the OISUPK or the OUPK, um, we they used to do military cadence and, and, and practice Marcus martial arts in Marcus Garvey Park in Harlem. He went and told the elders that shit, and he always told me that he was in the military. Then it comes to find out that nigga was never in the military. He was in that ROTC shit, you know, the shit for the school kids and shit. Shit was a little out there and shit, right? But... Then they broke the military cadence. So when you see that military cadence, that's Killer B's creation right there. That just show you how I was up in this motherfucker. But and, and there was another brother, a Spanish guy, that that brought the um the, the 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 martial art shit, right? The Wing Chun or whatever the fuck you call it, the Bob Marley shit. But um, it, it just shows that the discipline, right? It it, it gives the the group discipline, and they like the discipline. Cause it makes them feel stronger, like they're more they're they're really part of something. This motherfucker probably tell them that the UFO is gonna pick them up and everything. Let's go. Yeah, you ain't got it like that, nigga. But I can show you how to get it like that. Fuck with me. All I wanna do is be your friend. You know the other thing weird? He did it with his right hand, and all the other ones are doing it with their left hand. That's something I just picked up right there. We can see if he do it again and if he do it with the same hand as them. But it's strange that they're doing it with the left hand and he does it with the right. So that's another thing that shows him set apart from the group as the leader. All right. These hoes gonna listen to me, damn. These hoes gonna listen to me without money. I ain't got no money. These chains is fake. I got these from the flea market, nigga. I'm just doing this for image, bitch. This T-shirt from Walmart, bitch. I still got power, damn. Yeah. Up. You see the hoes listen to me. These hoes gonna always listen to me. Come a motherfucker. Pig, he just, nigga, but I'm we so we don't need we don't need money, right? But he using other people's stuff to live off of. He don't got no job. I bet they ass do. Oh, he found another flunky like the white dude that he had in his group that gave his whole life inheritance to. And he just ran through that shit when it was in Costa Rica, wherever the fuck they was. Pussy. Remember that. I'm pushing P. These hoes gonna listen to me. I'm a real nigga and that's my motherfucker. And at all time, remember, the black man is gone. Black man's God. The black. 
And if you leave, you ain't going to get no more information. You're not going to hear all the deep, dark secrets that he te of the carbon nation to get your mind right, to make you go to the next plane, to make you able to survive on the next planet or wherever the fuck. Let's go. And it's gone. The planet is gone. Say you have this control, Ken. I want to know what happened to the outdoors shit. They seem to be in society and shit a lot now when they was out in the woods ass naked. Before. He taught them to be naked so he wouldn't have to clothe their ass and support them. To your power. As soon as you tap into your power. We will suck your dick and lick your toes. We will suck your dick and lick your toes. Notice that? The left hand. <laughs> or maybe it's because he had the blood in his hand. He not lying. He not lying. Y'all ever shop at Walmart? I hate Walmart. I Walmart turns my motherfucking stomach. Every time I go in a, a Walmart... I got to argue with a goddamn employee over some dumb shit. A motherfucker sitting there, got tattoos all over his goddamn face, uh, using his cell phone, supposed to be ringing my motherfucking shit up. He on the guy, tell me to hold on a second. He on the phone. I'm gonna put you on, nigga. I got the piss. <laughs> laughing about it. Come back in the chat, bitch. Stop playing with me. Next time I'm smack you. I, I keep telling y'all. I keep I'm being a good motherfucker. I can set it right here on the table. See, the bitch try to help the other bitch. Like, you don't want that nigga smacking on your ass again. That's what a slap is all about. But I don't hit no bitch. I don't hit no bitch. Shout out to the real niggas out there watching from prison. Shout out to all my real niggas behind the wall. Shout out to y'all niggas. I'm letting you know that you can do this shit too, nigga. Shout out to Haiti. Yeah, I'm Haitian, nigga. I got that Haiti blood in me, nigga. And I'm Puerto Rican too, nigga. I'm Puerto Rican and Haitian, nigga. Let them know. God is Puerto Rican and Haitian. Look. See the kiss? Look at the kiss. Look, kiss, bitch. Now, pay attention to their kisses. They don't want to do what they doing. See? Look. You see that? Now look at him kissing her. Look. They lips are just touching. Look on the left. They don't want to do that shit. Look. She got a disgust on her face when she was doing it and pulled away and smiled. Damn, you got a bank account. You want to see my bank account? It's at zero. Why am I here? You don't believe me. My bank account at zero. Look, I'm going to show you. What about the other bank account, though? This is my bank account, y'all. My name is Elihio. Hello, Elihio. And this is my bank account, nigga. I'm trying to tell you, I don't have any money. Nigga, this is my bank account. Hello, Alihio. Bank of America. Nigga, this is my bank account, bitch. Play with God. I don't want your money. I don't nah. need your money. <laughs> this is my bank account, nigga. We heard this one before. I'm coming, my baby. 
See this shit? Y'all see this, right? All right. I'm Killer Be the Witch Ryan the General. You got a witch. I'm burning their asses up. I like to thank all my supporters out there. Brainstorm Homeschool Academy, Sister P, um, Y, Scary YT Streets, Arcader TV. Oh shit. I'm sorry. Arcader GT, Alana Rubenite, Nagy Sprayfield, Josh, Siberius the Sleeping Serpent, Yasu, Victor Always. San Miguel TV, Sahara Jr., Bill Hill, and Myron Edwards. And we up out of here. Like, share, and subscribe. Y'all like to send a donation. The link will be in the chat. Cash App Coke Buster. And with that, y'all, I'm up out of here. Lauren Hill video is coming soon. It's coming today. Stay tuned.